and safety is a top priority when this verdict is reached. And it's not just Kenosha preparing for possible unrest. Madison and Milwaukee are as well. Fox 6 is Ashley Sears is live with the plan to keep people safe. Ash. Ben, here in Milwaukee, the mayor and police department have been monitoring the trial. Kenosha law enforcement saying it's prepared and not sharing any details about strategy. The city of Kenosha has been through an enormous amount in the last year. It's a case that's garnered nationwide attention, drawing people to Wisconsin from all over. As many await a verdict behind the scenes, there is preparation. And it's critical that the, the follow up to this verdict um, be, you know, people speaking out peacefully and not engaged in any acts of violence or destruction. 500 Wisconsin National Guard troops are on standby in Waukesha County. Kenosha police and sheriff working closely with state and federal resources, but telling the community to continue its daily routine. In the summer of 2020, buildings and businesses were set on fire. The Kenosha fire chief says that unrest helped them with procedures and operations. When deliberations end, the department will ensure the safety of its citizens. We're monitoring this and we hope that whatever happens, it will be peaceful. Milwaukee leaders keeping their eyes on Kenosha, ready for whatever might happen closer to home. Our police department is prepared. With, there are no plans right now to call in the National Guard, and I, um, I don't foresee them right now. A nation watching closely with leaders calling for peace. I'm confident that, uh, that, that it will be safe. The Milwaukee County Sheriff's Office says there is no credible safety threat right now. They are working closely with regional partners to ensure safety and protect the First Amendment of any demonstrators. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Ashley Sears, Fox 6 News. Everyone's taking this very seriously. Ashley, thank you.